Drop a like within the next five seconds or have bad luck throughout NBA 2K22. I wouldn't risk it. Welcome back, Plug Nation. Today, we got a lot to talk about. So you already know, man, whatever you got to do, make sure that like button is blue. Hit that subscribe button if you're new, and let's get into the news. So real quick, I just want to get straight into it, man. Ronnie 2K during this 2K League Finals the other day talked about the, yes, everything we've been waiting for, park trailer announcement let me roll the clip and you guys can hear what he's saying. Remember though, it is Ronnie 2K, so take it with a grain of salt. It might not be true, but probably is. Uh, it's gonna be a fun week. You know, we haven't revealed anything with the, the city in my career, and that's a big thing, obviously, for the, for the fans of the 2K League. So, um, you know, that people can look forward to that on Tuesday, um, and I think people are gonna be really excited. Okay, I'm sure you guys are wondering, why is Ronnie 2K announcing the park trailer from his car? No, I'm just kidding. But it is happening on Tuesday. They did say it was going to be on the week of September 6th and Monday, which is tomorrow, September 6th, is on Labor Day. So they're probably not going to drop anything on Labor Day. They might, and I'm thinking that the part trailer actually might get leaked, just like the gameplay trailer did, and then they'll have to drop it tomorrow, and that'll be the only way that they'll drop anything tomorrow. So on September 7th is when we are supposed to finally get the park trailer remember it didn't just say that it said the city my career and my nba so i'm guessing they're going to be telling us a lot about the builder and stuff like that hopefully and it's not just going to be the park trailer but are they going to drop that on the same day i have no idea so 2k dropped a few things in their twitter talking about some gameplay dunk animations and all that let's roll that real quick so for the first time ever 2k is going to have dunk celebrations similar to jump shot landings where you green a shot and you do some sort of you know animation or dance i'm pretty sure you guys know what that is we don't really need to go further into that but as you see there's a bunch of them on here that they're showing it looks cool and there is a dunk creator as well which i'm really wanting to see also, so in this next one, they show that there is new jump shot celebrations coming to 2K22. Let me know how you guys feel about these in the comment section down below. But I'm not going to lie, it's pretty cool that they're putting new stuff into the game. I mean, we can all agree that it's just good that 2K is showing that there's actual new stuff in the game. Now, what is really important is great gameplay, but things around that really do help it as well. Good gameplay and you work your way down with great things and we can have a good year on 2k22 so if you guys don't know if you didn't see the last video this guy named stun amanda great leaked a bunch of 2k22 stuff i couldn't show it but we summarized it and talked about it in the video of course you know i still can't show it showed you uh powers tweet talking about it and we summarized it you don't even need to see the pictures from based on what i said but the cops apparently showed up to this man's house because he had 2k22 early let's roll the clip of what he posted on youtube Yo, what's up, 2K world, 2K community, you know what I mean? Y'all already know what it is. It's your boy, 550 Stunning Man, Miss Corn, like a fan blowing like an AC, your dick. Yo, today was a long, wild day, yo. Like, you feel me? Everybody know I had 2K for a couple days now, you feel me? I ain't gonna lie, the game hard, you feel me? You should go grab it. This shit like that, you feel me? Like, yeah. But, you feel me? Yeah, this shit went viral, you feel me? I threw up a post or whatever, a little clip, a little snippet for real. Shit went viral overnight. Everybody watching, subscribing, all that. Bro, the shit got so viral that Ronnie 2K or the 2K team sent the feds to my house. Like, they went and got whatever they needed to get to build up some information. And, you know what I mean? To holler at me, like, bro, give us the game. And you found me. That's it. But if you don't give us the game right now, they're going to proceed with what they got to proceed with. And then, yeah, whatever, whatever. It's a federal charge, dot, 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 I'm like, shit, you can take this fucking game. Fuck, fuck that game, man. But that was crazy. Like, damn, Ronnie is like that. I ain't even really. They was really mad because I said I was going to live stream at 10 o'clock. So they, like, literally got the feds to come to my house before 10 o'clock. Like, they, the feds told me, like, yeah, we had to get here before you live stream. Yeah, like, they really broke everything down. Like, yeah, like, they, like, them 2K people, don't, they don't play around. They don't fuck around. You know what I mean? That's like fucking with the Liberati, shorty. You know what I mean? But I ain't gonna lie. The My Team, lit. My career, lit. You know what I mean? Nice storyline. Fucking the WNBA, a.k.a. the W, 
lit, you know what I mean? Like, I ain't gonna lie. 2K came with it this year, shorty. But tomorrow, I'm gonna really, I'm gonna go through the comments today. I'm gonna write down hella questions that y'all asking me or whatever. And I'm gonna tell y'all exactly what's going on tomorrow. Like, so I'm gonna post and I'm gonna tell y'all exactly what, what it is that you wanna know. Like, uh, more about my team, more about the my player, anything you wanna know, I'm gonna. You know what I mean? Tomorrow, I'm going to drop another video. Stay tuned. All right. Well, yeah, you guys heard it there. A lot happened in that. He did say that the my career and my team was cool. He said it was a good storyline, stuff like that. So, I mean, I guess we got a little bit of information on 2K22. Also, in a picture of allegedly what is 2K22, we allegedly seen a little shopping mall. So, maybe the stores are a little bit different. I don't know. We seen a lot. I mean, he showed us a good amount of stuff, but didn't at the same time. And that's really the best way to explain it. And uh, just in case you guys are wondering, he did not go live the next day, which is today, and give us any more information about the game, really. I don't think that he said anything at all, even in the spaces and all that on Twitter, which we're about to get into in just a second as well. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it with him. And... Hopefully, someone else gets 2K22 early, but at the same time, guys, after that, I would say that although there is probably going to be some people that get the game early, they're probably not going to release any information because 2K goes hard at striking down that uh, information, that content, and you know people don't want to just lose their platform, whatever they're posting on right away, just for that one viral clip or something like that. So anyway, I also want to talk about, if you guys have seen throughout the community today, that I had a friend. That I've known for like two plus years now. We've done a lot of business deals together and stuff like that. He told me that he had 2K22 early, right? He literally has been hyping it up in the TNB clan chat for a few days. And so I brought him into a space. And it turns out that after about an hour, he just said he was trolling, bro. Trolling, yes. All that to say he was trolling. It was bad. We had lots of 2K YouTubers in there and stuff like that. Of course, everybody is like, you know what, Badge? I understand. It's not you all that you guys are lit i do appreciate everyone that didn't switch up on me but i just want to say that you know i had no part in that if you guys didn't see my tweets i did not know at all he was gonna troll i've already unfollowed him all that type of stuff and it's just it's tough but we are all waiting for 2k22 news man and the reason why all this is happening where stun a man and the guy today that we're just feeding for this information is because 2k has not brought out anything so it's like, as soon as we see something, we got to jump on it real quick because we're just so thirsty, man. We're all 2K fans at the end of the day, whether or not you guys like 2K or not. Like, of course, you know, I've said a bunch of times in my opinion on 2K21, I don't really like the game. I don't, but I'm still a hardcore 2K fan at the end of the day. So when I'm hearing about the next 2K, it gets me excited, it gets a lot of us excited. But now I've just learned, like, I'm going to chill till 2K22 comes out. I don't care if you send me a picture and or a video of you playing the game. I'm not buying it, bro. I'm going to just let someone else drop the information. I tried to do something for the community and give y'all some early stuff where he was talking about the game, but he said he couldn't show us any screenshots and stuff like that because he signed a non-disclosure agreement with the organization that gave him the game. And I believed it. A lot of us did. And it just wasn't true. So it sucks. But the game's coming out in a few days and we're going to see everything. So it's really not that big of a deal. Now, Ticino, as I'm making this video, tweets this out. And this is crazy, all right? $5,000 USD pot. Farewell 2K20 wager against Aiden and Speed. Tonight in two hours from 30... Two, two hours and... Okay, what is going on, Badge Plug? What are you... What? Tonight in two hours, 30, okay, I see it, so it's how you word it. Tonight in two hours, 30 from now, 2v2, best of seven. They hit me up with the idea, and I was down for it. Enjoy this gift of a show while it's here. See you then. So guys, let me know in the comment section down below who is about to win this wager tonight. Ty Sino or Aiden and Speed. Let me know in the comment section down below. Real quick, I'm just going to tell you guys that I appreciate everything. The next video is going to be about the part trailer that drops or you know gets leaked, something like that. We've done it. We're right here at the end of the news. There's only gonna be a few left. And of course, like I told you guys, I'm gonna be making news videos when 2K22 drops as well. But I just mean like news on the game before it comes out. And we've, wow, it's been a good two, three months. And I'm ready for 2K22, I'm ready for the grind. 
you guys know I was like the sixth or seventh legend on Xbox on 2K20. I'm going to be grinding this year the exact same way I grinded in 2K21 when the game first came out. I had like a thousand games played in the first month or something like that. We were going crazy. I just ended up not liking the game. You know what I'm saying? So I didn't grind for legend. But this year, if I like the game, I will be going for that legend. All right. I'm going to tell you guys my honest opinion, though, on both games. I'm going to try out both of them and literally tell you exactly how I feel about it. So that if you're one of those people that wait to buy the game, you're going to have my honest opinion. Or if you have one game and you're waiting to buy the next one, you'll have my opinion. And then you can go from there if that's something you care about. If not, it's all good. Okay? It's all good. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. Drop a like if you haven't yet. It's your boy Badge Plug. You've been plugged in. And I'm out. By the way, leave your opinions down below. I read every single comment. And I'm out. Peace.